It's Tuesday, July 21st, and today, what are we talking about today, Wyatt? Today we'll be talking about what the fish are eating in a stream. Welcome back to Hopping in the Flies Tuesday Tips. I'm your host, Carson Andre. I'm Wyatt Andre. And today, we're going to be talking about what the fish are eating in a stream. So even before we get in the stream, we're just going to give you some helpful hints and tips just trying to figure out what the fish are eating. One thing I do is looking under the rocks. We have some caddis, some crest bugs, and they're mostly all over the rock as well. This is a great way to know what the fish are eating in the water and what flies to use. Another thing to look at when you're trying to find what the fish are eating in a stream is look at vegetation. So we got some moss here. Oh yeah, yeah, we got some things in here. Okay, so we got some saw bugs, we got some crest bugs. And I'm not sure if you can see this, this is really small. We got a bigger one here. Let's see if you can see that. See them? And this is what the trout, most of the trout's diet are crest bugs and saw bugs because there's so many of them in the stream. If this video is bringing any value to you, please smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Another thing to figure out what the trout are eating in the stream is to look in the air. Many hatches pop off the water, either emergers or dry flies, and just sometimes people just bring a net with them. Either you can get spinners or just regular dry flies, and you can see what actually what color they are and they can figure out what fly it is that you can use to catch fish on the fly. Another thing to do is bring a small net and I'm going to be here stripping up the water so why it's going to see if we get anything up from the bottom of this creek and see if we get anything. It looks like that we got some freshwater shrimp and a lot of crest bugs. So as a result, we're gonna take a look at the crest bugs and freshwater shrimp, see what size they use and what color. Another thing to look at is at spider webs to see what insects fly in there and what to use. I really hope this video helps you the next time you're trying to figure out what bugs to use on the stream. If you really like this video, please click that like button and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next Tuesday. Till then, tight lines and stay fishy.